Hello, this is Haka Dabin, and today we are going to r slash liminal space. If you like this video, please uh, leave a like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. Now let's get right into this. Oh hey, liminal space is from Steven Universe. I love the, the art style in general of Steven Universe. I always found that really odd, like, how did I get the, the laundry machines to work there? And if they have a dryer there, why do they have, have a clothesline? Hmm. Oh, I remember this place. I love that place. It's an interesting looking place, honestly. Gas station that looks like it's from a PS2 horror game. Damn, LP is right, that does look like a PS2 horror game. Subway in Buenos Aires, Ar Ar Argentina. Wow. Cinema Corridor. Wow, look at all that blue. That's really pretty with the red ed as well. Like, I know these are level spaces, but you can still appreciate how pretty they can be. Oh, wow. I kind of think this one is edited, but anyway, it's really interesting to see a long fence and green in, in in yards, and then see just a completely dark sky with just a little bit of light at the very top of this picture. Any town USA, you can tell because all the roads have so many cracks in them, you, and you can barely see the lines. Literally any town on the USA. I wonder if that's like an actual place. Oh, that's a video. Toy store I used to go to. Oh, wow. We should get like pictures of like. A Toys R Us that doesn't have any people in it. That'd be really interesting. Would you play catch here? Yeah, this does look like a place that you would go playing catch with, like, your parent. Is this good or bad of Liminal? <coughs> I'd say it's... Eh... A long time ago. I don't know what this is supposed to be. Oh, it's a video. Nope. Right, why are you playing videos with sound? That's not loud. What game is this? Actually, I have no idea. Oh, a train station with no one else around. That's definitely liminal. An empty parking garage. Insane. Just come back safe and sound. Oh, the pool rooms again. Great idea. Modern mall. Well, what's the difference between this and the mall that might have existed like 10 years ago? Well, I guess it has a lot of bright lights to keep your attention. Ooh, I like that slide. That looks really cool. I love all the light strips everywhere. Look at this museum. Well, I guess it's just a part of a museum. 
The journey, not the arrival, matters. I love the idea of going through a tunnel and coming out, out in a space like that. It does feel very liminal. Kind of reminds me of the end of um, the Sending Parable. Dang, I forgot my soap in the bathroom inside my room. I have to get it. Oh, that's a long hallway to get soap. Music shop. I should learn how to play guitar. Oh wait. Deco a mission 1930s reservoir awaiting demolition. Oh yeah, those are like the best on most bases. When you get a picture of something in before it's supposed to be demolished, it's really interesting to see it. I saw someone else post this photo. Well, I'm not going to scroll through that. It's not going to work. Went to a liquor store or yesterday. This is the main entrance. That's an insanely cool entrance. Guava. I don't know what that means. I'm just reading the e titles. Probably should unless I unless I know they have something to do with the picture. Anyway, um, pink on green is a little bit odd to me. I wonder why I use blue lights. Um, blue lights are known for being comforting and calming. Although here it makes it seem way darker than it really probably should be for a library. Seems like it would be hard to read anything in, in that library, honestly. Does this look retro? A little bit. I think the stock white lights really it, it take away it from the feel though. I feel like people forget that um, for the longest time, I mean, what you consider as comfortable lighting is more a yellowish and warm color. And the white lighting I think of as like stuff that you'd see in schools or in um, Hospitals. It's not comforting. It's more stressful than anything, in my opinion. Anyway, stopped here for a while. Is this just a bench out in the middle of nowhere? That's really interesting and really curious to me. Alternative angle of weird hotel. Concrete funnel. I just wonder why, you know? Jungle Gyms Playland. Heck yeah. Remember we're going to places like that as a kid? I think I have a game that I found. It never ends. Me when there's another hallway. Otherworldly. Kind of hard to tell. Maybe I'm blind, but it looks pretty dark in that area. Any thoughts on this render so far? I think it's alright. I think the hallway ends a bit too was soon though. Maybe extend it a bit. A hallway inside of a building I worked in. This building looks more or or like a home than I really expected. Hallway in an old Hong Kong apartment. Nice. Midnight. Dark road with one bright light at the end of it. Alan Wake 2. 
Dryness. Make the world coffee. Okay. You just turned the world into coffee. Oh my goodness, why? There's a single street lamp and far off into the in darkness. Basement of a, of a school under construction. Wow, that's really interesting. A carousel by the former Sears. A Sears. Now that. That's some um, memories. That's interesting, though. Where the coffee is. You wake up here and don't know the way out, but keep going. Waiting for guests? They aren't coming. You're going the wrong way. What do you mean the guests aren't coming? I, I spent all that time making the place look nice and they aren't coming? How dare they? I just want to go home. That park does look a little bit scary, doesn't it? All clean, all clean. Look, it's just a light. I love seeing like bright lights of cities from far or off. My butt, it's cooked. Interesting. Oh, that was interesting. I don't exactly feel safe here, Chris. What an interesting room. This is a hotel room? like now this is your hat this is like a house but it's off somehow it like feels like a house that anyone would be what uh, I'd, I'd like recognize immediately and yet it still feels a little bit odd the abandoned restaurant okay I think that's a good stopping point that was r slash liminal space. If you like this video, please leave a like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. I have no idea what I'm going to be doing tomorrow, so until then, goodbye!